Hey YouTube, so this is the other guy coming to you from my kitchen. So in today's episode, oh tonight actually, in tonight's episode I am making carp bait. The reason why is, is because tomorrow is next year and tomorrow uh, my nephews who are from Southern Cal, they are here and my children, my boys, they all want me to take them go to go uh, fishing. Uh, right now, I heard through the grapevine while I, I was at work that they are stocking fishes up or trout up in Pine Flat. So tomorrow, we're going to be going up to Pine Flat. And up there, that lake, they have a lot of carp. And I know a lot of folks don't like to eat carp. I don't like to eat them too. However, I, I was told that the carp in that lake is the best tasting carp ever uh, in my county. So I'm gonna go up there. We're gonna to see if we can catch any carp. Uh, my cousin uh, taught me this uh, ancient recipe with uh, wheat and corn. So I wanna show you how I do this, okay? So, first, you need uh, shredded wheat, okay? Uh, this is 100% natural. We are not adding pollution to the lake, okay? So we need cereal, okay? And then, we need the Jolly Green Giant corn, okay? So, I already uh, did this. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pour this into here, into my blender, okay? This is my blender. And I'm going to blend the two together to make it into a pulpy, um, consistent, like a power bait consistency. And after that, it should be ready. And that's all you need. Corn and cereal, shredded wheat. That's all you need, okay? Not the sweet kind, okay? It's just a regular, original, non-sugar added nothing added a blend taste of shredded wheat see and corn yeah so that's what we're gonna do so once you gather your ingredients put this thing in okay and then put this thing in and slowly add the wheat onto the corn and blend Okay, I don't know if you can see this. If you don't have a blender, you could do it with a little, uh, you could blend it with a stick and a pot or a bowl and just mash it into a consistency of a pulpy uh, thing, uh, the consistency of a power bait. Okay, so here I go. Oh. Doesn't work because you don't have this. Oh, sorry, my boss. Uh, I don't, this is my, this belongs to my boss, so she's the pro, I'm not, I just ride along. Okay, so here we go. Hey, there's no blade. <laughs> Time out. Okay, sorry about that, guys. <laughs> I forgot to put the blade in. There. So you can tell I don't cook a lot. This blender belongs to my wife. She owns the kitchen. Well, I own the garage. Blade in. Okay. So I think that's it. And then the ingredient back in. Sorry about that. Don't cook a lot. You can tell by that. Love to eat, but don't cook a lot. Wife is a good cook. Okay, here it goes. Ooh, ooh. That's good. Okay. So it's going. Okay, we're gonna look in here to see how it's coming along. Oh, oh, sorry about that. Okay, so that's how it looks like. It's almost ready, but it's a little bit wet. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna add some more wheat into it to get that consistency. Okay.
and you have to have this in order for it to work. That's what my wife says. Take a look at here. Okay. And yeah, it's pulpy. So we're basically ready. Let me let me grind a, a, a couple more. Not grind. I don't know what that's called. Mix blend. Yeah, perfect. There you go. Basically, you want to have this consistency, which you could you can uh, bunch into a ball. And look, it's one hundred percent natural and edible. There, it actually tastes really good. So the the smell of the wheat and smell of the corn attracts the carp, and they love this. It's it's like a carp magnet. Um. The lake that I use I usually go to is uh, Hensley Lake. Um, I like the the uh, the carp there better than anywhere else. But I've never fished at Pine Flat for a uh, carp before, so this will be my first time. We'll see what happens tomorrow. But yeah, if you want to make carp bait, that's how you make it. It's really easy. You just need corn by Green Giant, okay, and also just need shredded wheat okay that's it and the consistency of power bait here see this is this is not uh it's it hasn't been made into a ball yet but if you squeeze it it has the consistency of a power bait and you just make it into a ball like this put it on the hook toss it into the river and it will not or not river uh lake and it will not uh, fall apart. Yep, that's it, guys. Let me know what your thoughts are.